6,000 replacement parts. To remove the respirator strap assembly, pull the upper legs from the facepiece buttons. Pry the valve cover assembly from the facepiece exhalation port. To replace the respirator strap assembly, position the valve cover over the facepiece exhalation port and press firmly to snap it into place. Push the upper legs onto the facepiece buttons. To remove an existing exhalation valve, remove the respirator strap assembly as you did before. Grasp the valve and pull it off the center post. Inspect the valve seat to make certain it is clean and in good condition. To replace the exhalation valve, place the new valve over the exhalation port. Insert the stem into the center hole and press firmly on the valve. Make certain the valve is fully seated and spins freely. If the valve does not spin freely, push on the valve again until the stem is fully seated in the center hole. Replace the respirator strap assembly as you did before. To remove an existing inhalation valve, grasp the valve and pull it off the center post. To replace the inhalation valve, press the hole of the valve over the center post on the valve seat. Be certain the valve is fully engaged through the valve post and lays flat. The two red gaskets are designed to seal the interface between the face piece and the filters, cartridges, or dual air line. They should be inspected before each use and replaced if lost or damaged. When installing new inhalation gaskets, make certain they are in proper position under all three bayonet lugs. Understanding how to properly and safely use, maintain, and secure your respirator is of utmost importance. Don't forget that the user instructions are included with the respirator. And remember to always ask your supervisor if you have any questions regarding respiratory protection.